Five. We're live. Huh. There you go. You're live. Hey, guys. Uh, I believe we're live. Uh, we don't have the ch Let me check the chat to see. We might not be, might not be amazing at this. Live now. Yeah. Go to channel. Uh-oh. I don't think we want to watch ourselves. Yeah, no. bear with us as we figure this out a little <laughs> bit. Oh, God. There we are. Oh, God. We're so beautiful. Uh huh. I'm gonna pause the video. All right. Where's the chat? All right. Um. Just went live. Good. Yes, the beer has arrived. I'm not gonna try to pronounce people's names. Achilles. Uh, PDX. Can we bring the chat up on that TV? Yeah, working on it. That arrow on the right, that little arrow up top. There Please enjoy these first few minutes as we awkwardly uh, get our tech set up. Talk to each other about what to hit on the screen. <laughs> Look who's there! Shut up, Pascal. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Wild Coder is one of us. Is one of our programmers, Pascal. PC version in the works? Question mark. Wasting no time. Yeah, all right. First question. That's always that one of the first questions. Also, is there going to be a German version? <laughs> uh, it's not up there. Oh, we don't have to answer no, it. No, I'm just saying. I'm just no, saying but we don't have to answer, answer it if it's not yeah, up there. Exactly. Uh, yeah, exactly. Uh, we're also going to wait a little bit just to see how many people show up, although it is already on. Uh, people in the chat, can you hear us all right? Should we mess around with the volume of ourselves at all? And then you have to wait 45 seconds for them to get it. All right. <laughs> for them to get it. And we'll wait a little bit. Sound good. Uh-huh. All right. That was great. Nice. That was really nice when you said uh, PC version in the works. I guess I'll answer that. Yeah, go ahead. Oh, this uh, is Mike Builder, by the way. Hi, everybody. Uh, not at the moment. There is not a PC version in the works at the moment. Um, it's possible. We're looking at it. Um, we're also looking at mobile and possibly doing like we did with the You Don't Know Jack Party on uh, on iOS. So we may end up exploring Fibbage on that market as well. All right. Uh, I'm Arnie. I'm one of the writers here. And uh, this is Ben. And Ben, what do you do? I program things. You program things? Yeah. All right. And we're going to have, at some point, we're going to have Steve-O, who is the lead writer and editor, and I guess director of Fibbage, so we can talk about the philosophy of writing those questions specifically. Uh, Achilles PDX wants to know Android version with Chromecast support. It's not, there's no question mark, so it's more of a statement. Uh, Chromecast is actually kind of harder because you can't really stream to it yet the way that you can with, with uh, Apple TV and stuff, but... As soon as that's as soon as that works, well, you you can, but not in the fashion we want to. I think. Yeah. Well, you have to you have to set up an HTML5 page that sort of like does it houses it all. Yeah. yeah. You can't just. So that might go hand in hand with a PC version. Yeah. Maybe. We'll see. Okay. Uh, Steve O uh, says, <laughs> "Tell him to make himself more comfortable." <laughs> <laughs> Fine. Okay. I appreciate I, looking through the chat. It looks like the majority of people in the chat are people who also work here. <laughs> <laughs> that yeah. Awesome. Crabby dad doesn't work here. Yeah, he does. No, that's Andy. That's Andy. Fuck. <laughs> <laughs> All, right. All right. So maybe let's go ahead and just start a game here. Let me start a game up. Let's yeah, see if it fills up. Let's colors. Make it a little more. Uh, oh, full screen, huh? Oh, and us. Look at that. Yeah, we're in the corner here. This is the game we made. Loading. Wouldn't it be awful if the game just uh, doesn't start? It's entirely possible. If only I had programmed it better. It's usually Ben's fault. So if you're in the chat room, go ahead and join the game. The room code is MGLA. Is, uh, is anyone playing? Uh, I'm not going to play because I know all the answers, at least this first time. 
but it, uh, we just saw the delay. We just saw it go up, so you better go fast if you want to get in. There are only eight spots. You should play the game immediately. Yes, Vanda Cooper, get in there. Play the game. Ned Flanders something. Oh man, look at these, look at these players. And see, uh, Achilles PX is saying we've got a pretty bad delay. Or they have a pretty bad delay. Oh, come delay. on! But they're also the first person in, so. Let's see, let's wait for one more person. Rooney, huh? Alright. All right, before we start, I hope it goes without saying, please no uh, things that will make everybody unhappy to see. No slurs against races or sexual preferences. Or no using the, the, the names of anybody's mother. Or well, as, yeah, okay. as, a, as a... You as can a, definitely use Ben's mother's name <laughs> in as many of these as you want. <laughs> what are we that was my mom? <laughs> I told my mom about the She might be yeah. about it. Hi, too. Dad. <laughs> All right, here we saying. go. Masterson, and this ain't my first rodeo. I go to that next week. Whee! We're working with a full Ned boat Flanders today. The second As a good luck charm, favorite. I'm going to call this group the Titanic. Let's do this. This is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. So, pulled. Builder, you're fine. 1,000 for finding the truth. Which one is that? Oh, category. Dead, I knew it! Dead, uh, I knew it! What are you talking about? <laughs> I knew it! Oh, it has to be. Yeah. So Mike is playing as Ben's mother. <laughs> yeah. So that's my life. David Blaine once wrote, The most courageous act a man can do is blank. Now use your device to type a lie that Magic. will fool the other players into believing it. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Two points. minutes delay. Do Come on, now. really? Two minutes? Is that an exaggeration? That seems or? ridiculous. I, uh, the delay on our that we're seeing is like 45 seconds. Way less than that. Hey, nice! It's kind of achievement. I don't know if anyone cares, but I wrote this question. Should I say it for every question sure. that comes up that I, I wrote? credits for everything. I, I wrote know, this one, so I, if you like it. I programmed this one. Hurry, so. hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Okay, here are your choices. Find the truth oh, and enter it on your device. <laughs> <laughs> I'm glad that we have a, a British person in this thread. Mm -hmm. Apologize for that. Impersonate Ben's mom. That is the most, the most courageous thing a person can do. <laughs> You'd be surprised how uncourageous it really is. <laughs> Considering the frequency with which it happens. This is where we'll find out how many people have played. Right, who picked what? Enough to know all the answers. Mm-hmm. Good work, Dan Cooper. <laughs> Only at my house. <laughs> Actually, the, 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 the thing's only behind like 15 seconds. Yeah, I know I hear it's not bad at all. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Hmm. A lot of people got it right. Just by, uh, I'm just curious in the chat, how many of you have what? played the game before? And how many of you uh, already know some of these answers? You don't know Adam Image. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Oh. Okay, here's the question. Uh, oh, is this Adam? Yeah, right. Adam. Uh, I think Allard did. I think Allard made that. Who's Adam? He can pop his head in. Who's Adam? Did you make the you don't know Adam image? Remember uh, years ago, right? Adam? Yeah, Adam is uh, one of our fans on Facebook, and he, we made a you don't know Adam thing for him on our Facebook page at some point, right? We did? That was him. That was me. Sorry about that. He's not sorry. I really am, actually. 
Dexter. The answer to this is Dexter. A Dexter? Yeah. A Dexter. Oh, it's like a Dracula. That's it's actually a that's a Dexter. Apparently, I think that just like just happened. Oh, we lost somebody. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> I'm just gonna say the ones that are my favorites. Uh, Taco. Ouija board. Tacos made me do things before. <laughs> the problem is I've played this game roughly 8,000 times, but I know almost none of the okay, answers. Then you should be blind. <laughs> I used to say that name. T dot. Steve O says, Ben, if you hold up a fourth chair, you can stretch across that too. <laughs> <laughs> By the end of the game, Ben is going to be laid across the chair. He's <laughs> now. He did not want to be. I don't, I, who in the chat wants to see more of Ben? <laughs> <laughs> Wow. We're gonna pick everything on the board. Yeah, that was and that a lot of answers. Alright, pick a category. Brandy Cooper, Bradley Cooper is like bro. Okay, here's the question. Bandy. Bandy as in um, Sly Bandicoot, maybe? Buttocks. That's my favorite game. <laughs> that was a, that's a great game, Sly Bandicoot. Hey, if only this question wasn't used in the trailer <laughs> it's, to it's the game. Called, it's, called, it's called Sly Cooper. Right. It's Sly Crash Bandicoot. Bandicoot. Those are, oh, yeah. Those are very separate Aww. games. <laughs> For the trivia, yeah. I don't think they ever played a video game. <laughs> Writing trivia has destroyed okay, my brain. Your choices. Too many. <laughs> Too many buttocks. Too many gets my, like, my, uh... <laughs> my non-digital life. Tasty. <laughs> That's the worst. <laughs> <laughs> you shame if Deb put Tasty in there. If you're in the game, you can just hit the like button to show how much you like it. Please don't hate me. Uh-oh. Sly Cooper and Crash Bandicoot. Was I correct? Yeah, right. Intentionally uh, smushed those together? That was uh -oh. a big one. <laughs> smush. <laughs> smush has been brought up. <laughs> well, now I know what to tell the barber. And I'm going to take another line up there. Oh man, T dot before. <laughs> T yeah, the, the most clever name is T dot for eight for eight for eight, for eight, for eight. Two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. Wasn't on the screen that long. What's the story behind those the 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 stuff in the the round settings? The art? Some other stuff? No. That's just, uh... You mean like the lamp? The lamp and the lamp. I love that That's a Tim special. Yeah, Tim's not here to talk about it. I've heard Tim say that he wanted the game to feel like you're going into, like, a hipster haunted house. It's just perfect. Like, that was his inspiration. I think we started with the kind of, like, wallpapery background. Is the rumor that Cookie would be making guest appearance true? Uh... I... How do you know that Cookie's not in here now? Yeah, maybe... No, uh, Cookie is not here. I think Cookie will not be here today. We're going to try to make this a regular thing. In fact, we're going to do this every week. And almost certainly Cookie will be on Seaman. Right, where's the, the truth? On, on Seaman. <laughs> Cookie will be on the stream very soon. And possibly regularly, depending on how busy he is. The voice of Cookie uh, works out of another city. Yeah, he's in New York. He's in New York. And we're in Chicago. And he doesn't leave his house very often. Grilled cheese. And add cool 2000. I'm sorry that the only reason you're here is the host of Seaman Cookie. Let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> just, Please just accept a lounging Ben. Right, just pretend Ben is Cookie for <laughs> our, our, our number of viewers just like went down by eight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Chloe Silverado is the best name I've ever heard. I do like I feel that. like that's like the fun of like, a, like an author of a romance novel. Yeah. 
Nice. I bet it went right down. And that's it. Not just fibs every week. We're gonna play all kinds of different stuff, including um, showing new games, uh, debuting them, so no one's seen it. And maybe one week I'll just I'll play Shadows of Mordor, and I'll just be just just lay on the couch. Just be me play on lay on the couch. We play, play a lot of play burger. Games. We play a lot of burger time here in the office. Would there be a way that street we could burger stream burger a burger maybe. time tournament? Yeah, maybe Honestly. we could. Or, 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 the, or the basketball yeah. catch and shoot game that we have. Yeah, pop shot. <laughs> Enter your lies now. During a famous food fire. Ball. I like the weird specificity, but also vagueness of during a famous fire. <laughs> so you didn't write this one? I right? did not write this one. No. Hurry, hit the lie for me button if you can't think of it. <laughs> Which uh, one rocks? <laughs> Who's at Goal 2000? <laughs> my mom. My mom. Ben is the unfortunate one over there. No, I am unfortunate. I think that's Adam at Goal 2000. Oh, is that Adam? <laughs> Wait, Dachshund? That's good. I really don't know the answers to any of these. I'm always impressed when people can so properly it. spell a word like that. I can only spell it because I have one. I was good. That was mine. Oh, really? I'm sorry, that was Debs. <laughs> My mom is a really good liar. his own beard, so there was no way he could have seen it coming. And that means some of these didn't get picked. Oh man, it's a two, look at that, look at that tie. Yeah, wow. Chloe Silverado, author of several young, adult, C young adult erotic novels. I want to know the origin of the name T.CR48. <laughs> he died. He on his keyboard and died. It looks like Still three, playing. three license plates just smushed together. It's most likely to go to blank. I wrote this one as well. In case people still right. uh, Everybody it. hates this one. Why are so many of your questions Sylvester Stallone? <laughs> He's just a fascinating man. More than one person wrote the same thing. Got that, got that achievement. Let's so you get the achievement play. beforehand, before you see the reveal? Yeah, that's when it happens. When the second player puts something in. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. <laughs> Prom alone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Thank you, chat people, for having such funny answers. I highly value a funny answer over a, a, a possible answer. Yeah. I'm always in it to get the. I don't think Arnie's ever won a game with this. Yeah, I'm <laughs> not a, I'm not, a, I'm not a driven to win person. All the draw, draw development. I don't know. All right, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> T. Dot Kerfaho four. T. Dot Kerfaho. What? What is the origin? What does your name mean? <laughs> there is a story behind it, but there's no way it's as funny as whatever you're on match. Oh. I like that it's T. Dot Kerfaho four. As if you're the. <laughs> wow. A lot of people put jail. <laughs> Great minds think alike. Nice. I like this one. Oh, well, even though it's not. Oh, right, that's I like us. Uh, I shouldn't have been so confused by myself. Ah, I wrote that. It's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> I really like that thing I wrote. <laughs> yeah. That Wait, was, that's his actual. That that's his favorite. actual username in on Twitch. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be forcing my balls to buds to play this when I win it. My buds, not my balls. balls. <laughs> Why'd you say that? Man? I thought it said balls. <laughs> it's really far away. 
Everything is Ben's always, always seeing balls. So who's, so who's Adam? Is, it, is he like a, like a friend of the studio? Here fan. Is yeah. Your okay. final Long time. Play the Kayla Parade level? For a group yeah. Of fan. Enter your lies now. As we enter the final round, Steve-O, if you're still watching on the stream, maybe why don't you come in here and in between games, we'll chat a little bit about the making of the game. If not, I'll just go out and grab you. Well, he's watching. You get, no, you gotta wait for like 15 seconds for him to... Yeah, yeah he'll there. respond in chat. Me, I'll just say something smart ass about me sitting in his chair. Please, Steve, I'll come and sit in front of Ben. <laughs> Take his, okay, his foot seat away. Ah! Really spiky things. <laughs> pin cushion. I would have put. I would have put Pinterest. Ugh. That's what I would have put. That would have been the worst. Yeah. Mm -hmm. No one would have guessed that. Ah. God damn. There he is. What's up, guys? Yay, Steve-O. Steve Heinrich, director of Fibbage, right? Head writer. Pick something. Keep, keep talking, Arnie. <laughs> um, just all around good guy. Yeah. You don't know Jack. Current second place okay, ranking on Burger Time. Well, I still got out of 30 years. You don't know that. You don't know that I should be. You don't know that I have at the top of public mind, but. By then. Yeah. <laughs> I, I told like my wife that we were playing Burger Time. She was like, what is Burger Time? Uh, you don't have a wife. You want to play a character here, you can just be Steve O. That was that was that was you. <laughs> You've met my wife. I'll be forcing my I buzz. A woman that was not Paul's buzz. Oh, uh, Colorado. Close right. Colorado. Now I remember Adam's the piano guy. He did the whole Jack theme piano mix. Remember that? No? I thought that was Andy. Alright. Uh, let's see here. Let's do... Oh. Someone hit play close. again with different players. So, we can... This. You can guess... If you can guess the room code, we'll reveal the room code one letter at a time. <laughs> That's I, annoying. I like that Steve-O is standing in the Ned Beatty from Network spot at the end of the table. Does anyone... Remember the ominous uh, table that Ned Beatty's at the end of from really? Network? I, Network? I saw it once and I really didn't like it. So you didn't, I didn't, didn't like Network? No. Interesting. Okay. So you have to guess right. all the Mad four letter conversation, combinations that start with E. Yeah, good luck with that. It, should I get into Ned Beatty's post from Deliverance People? <laughs> yes. yes. Exactly. <laughs> that, is, is, that, is that Sarah Michelle Geller? Born on October 24th? That's my dad's birthday. Is that your dad? Is Sarah Michelle Gellis? <laughs> yeah. Hey, SMG1024199. Keep regaling us with your. October 24th, 1992. It's with you today. <laughs> <laughs> so, Steve, why don't you come and you can see what with the camera, and he's just, he's just zinger. Like zing. Yeah, that's how that works. I oh. promise we're going to start. Some people are going to have a camera. I promise we'll start another game in just a minute or two, but, uh, Steve, -O, yes. Plus, what's some of the behind the scenes? <laughs> of wow. Image? I'm a real James Lipton. I'm going to get another beer, I think. <laughs> I encourage everyone at home to quick grab another beer right now as well. All 16 of you. Uh, what? What's like the philosophy? What is like, what is there like a guiding philosophy in what makes a good Fibbage question? Good Fibbage question? Uh, well, uh, everyone should have a blank in it. <laughs> that and, helps. Uh... Yeah, I mean, um, it should be something that when you when you're writing the question, you know, Arnie, you read some questions. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It should be something that has like you can imagine there being at least eight or ten things that people yeah. might type in. Not that you're predicting exactly what people will type in, but yeah. you should be able to come up with things that you know that you know people at least won't be stuck. Yeah. And then it and then you, and you also should be it shouldn't be like, oh, this is like the most obvious answer that everyone's gonna type in. Yeah. And you get that a lot. You get that a lot. If the question's leading people in a certain direction, then yeah, that's gonna turn out bad. Uh, I, like, I like the I like the completely innocent ones that like beg for you to put something that is not innocent. Those are my favorite ones. Yeah, it's a real combination of a cr an ideally crazy fact that lends itself to the blank being the thing that's crazy. But like you said, there's a real variety of things you can put in the blank. Like the blank doesn't funnel you down into only two or three answers that everyone's going to put right. in. Right. But it is fun to have. There are a very small number of questions in the game 
that will make the majority of people put in one thing just so there's that mind-blowing moment where like four people all put in the same thing and you get to see that everybody said cow or whatever right, and right. that's, that's fun right. right or or uh, or what ben said which is a little more spoilery for the thing that's most likely to happen okay. uh and we actually get to we type in ex it's examples for them if they want to use the help button so that helps us to determine whether or not there's going to be yeah. a lot of good answers right? yeah exactly yeah we had to write how many i'm trying to remember how many prompts there's how, 16 there's six so if there's eight you'll play and each person gets two different i see ones. yeah yeah um let's see uh, i haven't been following the chat here <laughs> everyone's <laughs> criticizing ben basically and how loud he is what, especially as, the, which, which microphone is it so this one yeah, it's this one right here. Yeah, well, yeah, you're just like shuffling chips. You know. uh, well, the shuffling chips with the yeah. S, uh, SMG, we do need someone to play. We'll yeah. start playing just in one. just a minute just here. One song. Um, Who's Andy? Uh, Adam, you asked the question. Andy is um, our audio lead. He does all things music and composition and sound effects, and he works out of his house in Michigan. So we've got him on a VidCon all day long. Lead um, fart engineer. Yeah, he's got a lot of fart sound effects. Also. Yeah. And he's crabby writer. He's a writer. In the chat. Also a writer. He's, he's also does, a writer, that's right. He does the voice of Old Man. I think Adam is a big enough a fan that he'll definitely know who the Old Man character is. Yes. Yeah. Um, Although he denies it. <laughs> oh, that's right. He, he, yeah. he doesn't. He doesn't do that voice. Yeah. Um... Should we jump into a game? Hey, let's just play another game. Uh, let's see here. All right, ready? Uh, go who, ahead. Who, I, I'm not going to join this game. I'll do it. Okay. I'll play. Okay, let's, one letter at a time. Let's see if I can. EJ. EJ. Jack, you. Hurry up. You should at least get in there. Can't wait. Uh, How is he going to do that? You can't see it either. <laughs> you will in a moment. Uh, uh, Z. EJ, sure Z. Now everybody's like A, enter, B, enter, C. Enter. Yeah, they're going to make it. Q. I'm about Q. Q's my guess. Jeez, Arnie. <laughs> I really, I added all these weird. You got the world's largest iPhone. I do. Are you on the right controller? I think you're on the wrong controller. Yeah, you gotta go to finish. There, there, right. there it goes. Uh, e, J, Z. Put your name in. Oh yeah. Thank you. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> this is so dumb. Ready? Go. E. E. Will I be the first person? Oh, I bet I someone was. Yeah, yeah. Uh, you made it. Yeah, because there's a delay for everybody else. Everybody join our lovely game that we made. Boy, look at all these views. Well, we can add Skype into it so we can Who Skype, Skype in. in. Tom. <laughs> hey, Wait, what happened? No, no, Cancel! Stop. Cancel! Oh, oh, please, oh. no one start the game. Uh, there we go. No! no Cancel! Uh, Wait, I keep. Sorry, you're the one doing it now. No, the yeah. worst. <laughs> I'm just. Uh, Janet Snakehole. We need one more person. <laughs> <laughs> on, Janet Snakehole. I know it's not necessarily you. Where's Chloe? Oh shit! She made it. She heard, played her last game. I forgot Chloe's. Maybe it's Janet this time. Janet Snakehole, or... not a good author. Okay. Let me just go with seven. Uh, 420 Blaze It and Ganja Puffer are both here. <laughs> Similar interests. Oh. Okay, so you just go to fibbage.com and you enter the room code that's on the screen. As soon as we fill up more in another couple minutes, we'll uh, hit start and just start the game. Uh, while we wait for that last person, Bandit Cooper wants to know, do we have some thoughts about making games available in other countries? Like, I'm from Brazil. I can play, you know, Jack and Facebook, but nothing else. Great. I'm pretty sure Fibbage is available in Brazil. Yeah, me too. So I check again. If you have an Xbox One or a PS3 or a PS4, Fibbage should be available in Brazil. Um, or a Fire TV. Is Fire TV? Or a Fire TV. Fire TV is like mobile, and you can just... Check the box and it goes worldwide. The consoles are a little different. Israel. We are not in Israel. Um... <laughs> uh oh. Electric, Electric Mayhem's playing as two people. What? Is... A... Oh no, they're just changing names. 
Electric Mayhem said, we're Jan Snake Hole and Chloe Silverado. What's wrong, Pascal? I don't know. It's full? All right, start it up. All right. Everybody's in. It doesn't look full. No, it doesn't, but... All right, do we want to switch? Hello, Allard. Welcome. Hi, Mike. Hi, Arnie. Wait, hey, open your shirt first. Eight my shirt? Yeah. Uh, we're white and better as player. Let's do this. What the? F this might not be delayed. It could be something with the stream stuff we're doing. Yeah, it has to be. Get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer, and you'll get a thousand for playing. You're not playing. I'm not playing. Oh. Alright. Alright. Besides, now finish the chat. I'm worth 12. Yeah. Well, Larry Dog, 64. I'm working for the delegation right now. Okay, here's your first question. Oddly enough, Albert Einstein's eyeballs can be found in a blank in New York City. First. Type in your lies hmm. now. Albert Einstein. Couldn't get in, it was it was full already. Sorry. Fills up quick. It does fill up quick. You know, next time we can uh, put the uh, room code. Wants to know why. You're cheating. Will it actually show up? I mean, it's pretty small, so no one will. Yeah. You're just trying to show off your new giant phone. <laughs> My new giant phone. All right, it's where's crazy. the truth? But they got. No, Israel. They wanted in Israel. Oh, they're asking for the cave in Israel. They wanted. Israel. Yeah, no, it was like. I was I thought were found in an Israeli? I, no. Oh yeah. No. 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 <laughs> I'm confusing the chat with potential answers. That's uh, not what's yeah. going on. I'll, I'll try to write that. I really don't know what the answer to this was, so. Butthole. That's All right, who picked everything we hoped for. Da bum. <laughs> ah, cookie jar. Wow. Oh. Either too plausible. The code to the box is EMC2. <laughs> That's just a little science humor. And that means some of these didn't get picked. If we play a fourth game, is Ned Flanders the third going to be Ned Flanders the fourth? It's quite possible. Select a category. I'm really curious to see what Ganja Puffer picks. Is that a kind of fish? Yeah. Wake up, Ganja Puffer! You know what, we'll just stick with this one. <laughs> okay, here's the question. A woman in Muncie, Indiana was hospitalized after trying to remove a callus on her foot with a blank. Enter your lies now. <laughs> and so who wrote this one? I don't know. I think I might have. One of our writers, I think. Yeah, yes. <laughs> it just appeared in the game, magically. Ben didn't write this one? That wasn't a programmer question? Hurry, hit the that wasn't a programmer question for a while. I did write this one, I think. It's all a little bit of a haze after a while. It's hard to remember. Hey, which one's the truth? I know every line of code that I wrote. By heart, and memory. Yeah. Because he stole it. Line one of Pippage. If. If. Saw butthole shotgun chainsaw. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. You just sort of read the read the read the answers in order. And right. It's pretty fun. Let's sing it. Great lie there. So, Steve, about how many generics would you say are in this game? Generic pieces of audio? Yeah. Uh, like, and what? A, maybe what is a generic? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, generics are the host when he's like, you know, and let's see what you picked, and here are all the answers, that kind of stuff. Mm -hmm. So you want to have enough that doesn't sound like it's a cold sword. Yeah. Uh, I don't know exactly. Some of, these some of them have up like up more than ten versions. Of them. Yes, it depends on how often it's going to be played. The ones that are played more often, I do more versions. I like the ones that don't come up that often, but you know. like, what do you? Th what do you think is the uh, most? 
rare audio that would play in place. The most rare would be if all eight people type in the same thing. Yes. Yeah. But there is audio There is audio, though. That's, that's, that's the Jackbox game's way. Is there an achievement for that? We didn't do, not, we didn't do an achievement for that, too. Is that what you're saying? It'd be a good one, actually. <laughs> yes, he's live. <clears throat> I think we have even more more obscure audio than the eight person thing. I think there's one where it's like three people put it in and then four people put it in. Welcome to the chat, Henchman Joe. Yes, uh, we're the developers of the game and we're playing. Hopefully, you can jump. Yeah, you can jump into the next one. Hopefully, you gotta be fast though. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Touch of poo. <laughs> Touch of a child. <laughs> Let's see if someone can win the entire game by putting butthole. Is every answer uh, someone's uh, trying? You know, that person would be me. <laughs> <laughs> the old butthole victory. Uh, uh, so Allard, Allard is our Allard is our head okay, artist, right? Or what, would yeah. you, what is your title? Yeah. He draws all our heads. I draw heads. <laughs> Um, so give, it's like super uh, bad. Oh, no. come on. Give great direction. That's good. <laughs> I didn't say it, Ben. You just put it in my mind. I was trying to remember how Tim Sniffen described the inspiration for the art in Uh He described it. Uh, I should probably look on Facebook. But it has to do with stained uh, wallpaper. Um, he said hipster haunted house. Hipster haunted house with stamp wallpaper, grungy wallpaper. Means... Which, when he first did this design, it wasn't grungy enough. It was a little too perfect. Yeah. So he kind of uh, he aged it up. He distressed it, as we say in the art business. Uh -oh. I've heard that word. Happy birthday, seven in the art business. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and I was pretty distressed that I had to go and redo all the art. Hello. Hello. It's like 7th Dementia. That's right. It's a lot of dimensions. Seems like a perfect birthday party to play Fibbage in the evening with some friends. Oh, yeah. yeah. Uh, there's a question from Ben. <clears throat> I'll let Mike in a minute. Um, Wait, why don't we read the question? It says, uh, DLC possible or just keep refreshing the game with new questions? Question mark? Both are possible. Uh, there, uh, there's a number of things in the works over here right now, um, and over the coming weeks we're going to be talking more and more about them. Um, but needless to say, uh, there's more footage coming as well. So how that happens, if we're going to do DLC or update the game or something else, um, a little bit TBD. But um, it takes a while to write the stuff and record it all, and so unfortunately you can't just drop it in quickly. But we're still working on more. So hopefully that makes you guys feel a little better. And now, I'll give the excited version of what Mike just said. Yes! <laughs> <laughs> yes, we are, guys. There'll be stuff coming yeah. soon. Yeah, will there be more food? <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't have a good answer for that. Is it going to be DLC? Is it going to I don't know. But there's more footage coming. Down. <laughs> well, people know the answer to that one. Holy. That one's wow. slowly and, um, and a little bit. Yeah, I guess. I, I'm... Who picked Wee Man? <laughs> I did. <laughs> I enjoy uh, trolling. <laughs> yes, exactly. <laughs> Buttholes is really taken to that leg stuff. Uh -huh. uh, what about making a host for rooms? What about like a lobby? A question. Is that what that means? Sense? I assume so. Maybe like, so like you could see active games and join one? Maybe. Please clarify. Yeah, clarify. Yeah, explain what you mean by that. Sarah Michelle Gellery, I want you to clarify. Type in your lies now. Why does Playtex know this? Because they did a check in. Just stand. What did they make? Pantyhose? Uh, Undergarments? Wood? Canadian audio engine? Should we turn that up? Hurry up! Use a suggestion uh, if you can. Whoever wants to change the drown me out. Has anyone listened? Hi, Lyle. Where's the truth? Oh, I don't know. I wasn't listening. Uh, As you both said, it was good. <laughs> Giant pumpkin. That's funny. Had sex in a butthole. <laughs> there we go. 
You know, you stick with buttholes and eventually it pays off. <laughs> <laughs> That's a quote. Wait, that's so close. <laughs> Speaking of hosts, where's Regis? Uh, he's retired, Adam. We haven't seen him. Nobody's seen him. I was actually Regis's handler for the Who Wants to Be a You really wanna you wanna go on the record with that? What? Handler? Uh, what? <laughs> I was I was uh He was actually fond like him. I saw him. But you're playing, where are you going? Look how we're proving that you can play this game while taking a breath. When we recorded uh, Regis for Who Wants to Be a Millionaire, Allard shows up with Regis at 7 o'clock in the morning. Yeah. And there's only like two of us in the office. And then we open the door and Regis goes, Hello, Jelly uh, People! And he's like, Where are they? Where, where are the there Jelly People? <laughs> we were Jelly People. There we go. Yeah. There he is! Okay. And then uh, he recorded uh -huh. for a few hours and then he took a nap. There you go. <laughs> Or we had one of these in the bathroom for a while. <laughs> it was terrible. It was terrible. Yeah. Actually, the, when, when our alarm has gone off, the cops are always kind of spooked by it. They always draw their weapons up and just... And the rock. Okay, SMG, I understand now. You, I think you may have asked this question over Twitter, or if you didn't, someone asked the identical question. Um... So the everybody's in. So this game originated as a multiplayer game meant to be played in the same room, uh, and so the whole everybody's in button seemed to just work. Now when it's played remote over Twitch, you have issues where people are starting the game and you got to cancel because it's not full, and there's a delay and it makes it challenging. So I don't know if we're going to do an update to fix that in this one, but for future games, it's definitely something we're looking at for kind of lobbying up or saying we're ready to play. Um, I, it's a little inconvenient at the moment, but if you just shout and yell at people like Arnie does, stop, hit, and go, that seems to take care of it. <laughs> okay, which one's the truth? Don't worry, Henchman Joe. You'll be able to play. <laughs> I'm enjoying these answers. <laughs> Butthole? Question mark? <laughs> Was he nice? Was Regis nice, guys? He was actually kind of nice. We had dinner with him. Oh, yeah. We went and whatnot. There. Yeah, we went to, and then, you know, when we went to the dinner place, there was also a Chicago Bulls basketball player there. Right, right. So, like, the people at the steakhouse were just, like, beside themselves to how to, like, properly service two tables with two celebrities at them. It wasn't Michael Jordan, though. It was Ron Harper. Oh, Ganja Puffer. Nice Six Bane is here to try to steal people away to play their game. What? Join Casera's room. Fresh game. Nobody yeah. else is Screw you. Six hey, wait. This is this is not expected. <laughs> and Flanders. He showed basically everything on the controller <clears throat> besides the reveals and. Well, look, so uh, Twitch has been a happy accident for us, and we are excited that everybody's playing it this way. But the way that the game works is the whole server that runs, and uh, the controller and the server and the game all kind of talk to each other. And so Fibbage is built to only show what you see on the controller right now or on the mobile right now. So the idea of making the game suddenly show the scoring and all that stuff on the controller isn't an easy thing, it's not just a switch we can flip. But, again, we're kind of learning on the way people are playing these things. In future games, we're going to be able to send more things and more information to the controller so that you're able to play it when there's a big lag, or you can play it even if you're delayed you know, quite a, a distance or time, and it'll, it'll just work. So. Also, Henchman Joe, I, I, we've never heard of Cards Against Humanity. Yeah, what's that game? <laughs> or... Uh, yeah, they asked, did we look at other games like Question Anything, which I've actually never heard of, or Cards Against Humanity when we made this, was it inspiration? No. No, I mean, we definitely, we like Cards Against Humanity and have played it. I don't know that we necessarily had, we're thinking of Cards Against this, Humanity when This we idea, it. actually, for this game is an old idea we have from many years before, actually before Cards Against Humanity ever existed, so. Before, I don't even know what you're talking about, Steve, though, that's not true. Yeah. I would say there's <laughs> when, we were talking, when we were doing uh, Screw Your Neighbor, that game that we were making? Oh, yes, that game. I would say there's a lot more 
balderdash in the DNA that there is presence. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. Way Kiko Oats. But as you would imagine, we play all those games. Yeah. We play Cards Against Humanity. We play all kinds of card games and parlor games and stuff like that. And in a way, all that kind of stuff is inspiration for the party games that we make. You didn't offend us, but Ben is always offended. So I'm can't. offended, and he's also very offensive. I'm way more offensive than I am. See, look, it's getting our way. Where is my sword? Calm down. Calm down. Larry Dog. But yeah, we love Cards Against Humanity, and there are Chicago, many of those folks are based uh, based in Chicago. Yeah, we've had some of them over. Yeah. Um, it's gonna be too late. There's gonna be, <laughs> we might have to quit this and start it again. Well, we don't need to. We don't need to be in. We can just laugh at them. Uh, yeah, I don't. Yeah, go ahead. Join now. Join now. Do it. Maybe I'll join. Who is M Dog? Mmm, dog. Vagina might. Fontal Roy. I am in, I think. Henchman Joe, you are. And Flanders the Fourth made it! Sure. Alright! <laughs> Wait, who won the last game? I was looking for my sword. I was looking for my sword. You lost my little sword. Alright, there are eight people, so one of you press start. Poor Adam, oh, he's work. not getting in. I'm sorry, Adam. But uh, Kassara's room is a fresh game. <laughs> Six pain, <Bane> says. <laughs> Jesus came to help you now. Yeah, Jesus. Yeah. Even he didn't get a spot. Yeah, the other no. day I was, I was thinking about the term Jesus fucking Christ. Adam, don't go home. Just all of a sudden. Let's maybe <laughs> turn the volume down. <laughs> okay. This game is going to be a No, if you right click. What do you want to turn on? Our bar? No, no. Go to the bottom one, I think. Ever media? Right click it. Let's do this. And you can make the bar go down. Yeah. Okay, so we're louder? Yeah. Okay. Look how loud we are. I can't tell how loud we are. Choose a word, Ganja Puffer. Uh. Since none of us are busy playing, although Aller, did you get in? You probably. I did not. Get in. Aller did not get in in time. Any more questions for us, guys, about Fibbage or just uh, our games in general? Ben's relaxation techniques. Would you relax? Echo is happening. Oh, is there echo? Yeah, let's turn. Maybe turn. That's why all those Twitch streamers wear headphones. Yeah. Really? Yeah. Like there's an echo on the video. They're probably hearing the game. Like, do we even need to hear that? The game gets picked up through our mic and goes right. back. Yeah. Could we? But we're streaming the. We can turn the volume up and then just mute this for ourselves, so that people could still hear, but we wouldn't hear. Whew. I don't yeah. think we do. We hear actually. No, no. I mean, just mute the. Or I could just turn the I mean, volume down over enough. there. Or yeah, just use your remote to turn the whole thing down. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, we can do that. Yeah. Can it be just But I would still put that down a little bit, right? I hope everyone is enjoying us debating. <laughs> yeah, first, first uh, Twitch stream yeah. on the equipment in here, yeah. so bear with us. Yeah. But yeah, for anyone that's new, we're hoping to do this every week, probably on Friday. We might differ with the exact time a little bit, but if you. Follow us on at Vivage or at Jackbox Games or at You Don't Know Jack on Twitter or our Facebook page. Uh, and that means that. Some of these we'll always announce when we're going to do this. We're going to start doing this every Friday. We're going to be playing Vivage and a bunch of new games as well. Uh, when is You Don't Know Jack coming to PS4? Ooh, that's Ooh, a real good that's question. Good question. Um, You'll see. It's coming this year. How about that? Yay! Yeah! Where's Steve-O to be? To yeah, we need Steve-O to go. The correct answer is, the IT'S COMING THIS YEAR! Here, the unusual <laughs> <laughs> duck with a blank. 
Uh, don't have an exact date for you yet, but coming soon. How about Mike that? Wilder? Uh, they promised Cookie would definitely make an appearance next week. And I don't think we promised that. Did, Did we, we promise that? No, we, we didn't promise that, that Adam. We have Sorry. not talked to the voice of Cookie about this, but the voice of Cookie will definitely... Who is, be who is Mike Wilder? <laughs> <laughs> That's pretty great. Uh, oh. Turn the game audio down. Uh, Daddy, Dad, do you still want the game audio down even more? Your choices. Or can you not even hear us over the game audio at this point? Andy, just relax. It's like talking to people on Mars. It's just yeah, it's kind of really broadcast on Mars. The game audio is too loud now. Yeah. Can you? Let's see what everybody right. selected. Better. Will the next You Don't Know Jack be coming to PC, to the Amiga? We're going to be releasing it to the Amiga. <laughs> Amiga 5000. You almost done with that port? Yeah, yeah, I'm working on the Amiga port. All right. 7K of RAM. I think we can fit. Hey, Moof Murphy. What's up? <laughs> hey, Moof. <laughs> SMG wants to know, says, I love Family Feud. Do you guys have the license to make one? No. No. <laughs> yes, we're just not going to do it. That would be... No. If you had to guess, how expensive is the license to make a Family I Feud game? I have no idea. One billion. I have no idea. Uh, I, would, I would have said a little while ago it wasn't super expensive, and then it's on all the next-gen consoles now. I, I, at least it's on PS3. At least I don't know if it's on PS4 yet. It? But it's it's. Can we get Steve Hardy? It's a three point in here. Royalty rate, you know, like, or like. Yeah, and it's a big. Uh, it was, at least in social mobile, it was big for a little while. So. Yeah. I would imagine the price tag went up recently because of that. But really depends who, on who, who the host is. I think all that stuff goes through waves. Thank you, Moof Murphy. You are awesome. <laughs> I like the way that Steve Harvey just kind of flirts with all the like the women in the. It's in not on PS4. Okay. Isn't that the tradition of that show? PS3. Yeah. We need to do that in Fibbage, I think. I think we're going to do a lot more of our own games than licensing other people's games. So if you like Fibbage, and if you're fans of You Don't Know Jack, there will be more of both of those, and stay tuned for new cool stuff as well. Which one of us is the bald guy on the logo? Allard. Allard? You want to answer that? No, it's Allard. Which one of you is the bald guy on the logo? None of us. It's actually a... Uh, it was originally this guy, Mick, from uh, uh, Yugoslavia, and uh, he was a male <laughs> model in L.A., and uh, there were a lot of myths about Mick, whether he uh, had died of cancer, all these terrible things, but this is all untrue. He's alive and well, living in Yugoslavia, and has a wonderful family. Him and Allard are married now. No, we're friends on Facebook. <laughs> we're friends on Facebook. Oh, really? So, yeah. Because I picked his head out of a, a stack of different headshots. <laughs> They were literally covering half the face just to kind of see who they were. So, I'm, I've never really talked to you about this. The process, so the first was the idea that you wanted half a head, right? Just like, how did that come about? How did the half a head come about? What was um, the genesis of that idea? Well, this guy I worked with, uh, Mike Gibson at Berkeley Systems, was a great uh, graphic designer and package designer. And uh, he... Uh, had this as one of his concepts, and I was like, I like this because it kind of reminded me of the, like, I wanted to see all these shelves filled with heads. Yeah. Kind of like in some sort of creepy, you know, catacomb <laughs> kind of <laughs> walking dead <laughs> level. Yeah. 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 So uh, we did that, and then we put the UW deck on the head, and I don't know, we focus group tested it. That was yeah. like one of my first focus group testing experiences. Harry showed it to his mom. No, no, <laughs> Harry, Harry didn't have a lot of pull with this. The box design, because uh, that was a Berkeley system, so we yeah. designed that. Um, and he, uh, oh, yeah, anyway, the box did really well, focus group testing, and we were like, okay, let's pull the trigger. No, so then we went, we shot a bunch of uh, photographs of this guy's head. Uh, and Tiny Italians. Uh, what? I'm sorry, I'm sort of trying okay. to read some of the stuff from the chat. But, but, but so well, you my, went, story, my story's over. No, no, it's good. <laughs> but how many, how many like, head, head shots did you go through to find the right head? I probably went through about uh, 50 to 100 head shots for the right head. 
from. And then later on, when we had less money at Jelly Vision, we uh, decided to make our own 3D head. So. Yes. So now that's why we have the 3D head. That's why we have 3D head. And also it would be, you can't so really... It's not, it's not Nick. Well, it's based on Nick, but it's, it's Don't not Don't tell Nick him that. Yeah. Um, but Nick's aware of it. I mean, he's, he's, he's likes my posts on Facebook. But. Uh, Adam, we don't really... Adam says, don't forget about acrophobia. We... We didn't make it. We had nothing to do with it. Yeah. Did, did I say Mike Gibson, not Mark Gibson? I meant Mark Gibson. Thanks, Krabby Dad. Um, why, do, why does everyone think that we made Acrophobia? Alan, do you know? uh, because it was a part of the uh, Ber Berserkly systems. Uh -huh. Berserkly, or Berserk was a sort of a, the first sort of game portal yeah. in the late, no, early 90s. And uh, Acrophobia was one of the other products that was up there, hosted by Berkeley Systems. Along with You Don't Know Jack, the first streaming game ever. Uh, but, yeah, Acrophobia is design, designed by somebody else, who I can't remember anymore. Yeah. Uh, but Ac I played Acrophobia at the time. It's a great game. It is a great game. Yeah. Uh, I see a lot of people on our stream are chatting about the Let's Play of, um, of Fibbage, which we've watched here as well. It's really funny. We enjoy watching other people play our games. Uh, we will frequently jump into people's Twitch stream of this game. Sometimes we'll tell people it's us. Sometimes we won't. Uh, we love. We just like seeing people play. Yeah. Usually, and, usually we go on there and we we say things that are rude. <laughs> Get drunk. Uh, let's see. I thought I saw another question, but maybe not. Uh, thank you for your. Are you smarter than a fifth grader? Comment. <laughs> that sounds relevant. I think I need more boxed wine. Uh, will you mind getting me a beer? Actually, I'll get you a beer. Uh, I'm sorry we've been talking so much that I haven't really been paying attention to the game that much. Has it been going well? It sounds like not well at all. Have the answers been funny? Since we're going to stream the game for you guys, you can at least go buy it so that we can make more. Yeah, we love people playing it over Twitch, but if you love the game we, we uh, and you have a system that you can play it on, we obviously appreciate it if people do buy it, because the more people buy it, the more stuff we're going to be able to make. Oh, shit. I didn't get you the same thing. Oh, that's fine. Thank you. Oh, He's not picky. I wrote this one. Florida man choked to death on cockroaches he ate while trying to win a blank. While trying to win a ganja puffer. <laughs> Has any, here's my question. Has anyone in this game put buttholes in? In my absence. <laughs> like a callback to the previous game. Murphy, Murphy, thank you for buying it when you get the chance. We really appreciate it. I guess I can wait till May, Jesus Christ, Pope. <laughs> Butthole Emergency is the name of my band. It's <laughs> pretty good. So, Allard, how long have you been with? Jackbox games, formerly Jellyvision games, formerly Jellyvision. Uh, well, let's see. It depends on how far you really want to go back. Mm -hmm. uh, in terms of the You Don't Know Jack franchise, I've been involved with that since 1995. With the very first game? With then? the very first game. So I was the art director for You Don't Know Jack, Volume 1. How was it you came grade? to it from the publisher side, is that correct? I came to it through the publisher side, right. I was working at Berkeley Systems, and I developed products... Uh, I'd done a little work on some of the screensavers at Berkeley Systems, and then I also did this product called Expresso, which was the first skinnable uh, calendar program. And then I did some other stuff, and then Harry Gottlieb came to Berkeley System and showed this hypercard demo of You Don't Know Jack. Uh -huh. And the rest is history. Yeah. So. 
Uh, but then I went to 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 Disney. Then I came back, hired Jellyvision to do Who Wants to Be a Millionaire for Disney, and then. In 2000, I actually took a job at Jelly Vision mm -hmm. and decided to join the cult yeah. of Jelly Vision. Yeah. So. But we so are now Jackbox Games, although you're yeah. also with Jelly Vision. I'm still also with Jelly Vision, too. Yeah. Uh, let's see if there are any good stuff from the chat here. Uh, Seventh Dementia will buy it if it comes to PC. Hopefully it does. No promises, but who knows. Uh... Uh, SMG asks, is this only on PS4? It is currently on Xbox One, PS3, PS4, and Fire TV. Um, it is not, however, everywhere in the world. Um, so it may not, may or may not be in your country, depending on what country you're in. Um, Henchman Joe was wondering who that person in the back of the room was and why they didn't move until they realized that it's a standee <laughs> of Regis Philbin from our Who Wants to Be a Millionaire days. I kind of the money he's paying. That's not a million dollars. Uh, no. Um, what else? Uh, the Haku says the first thing that pops into my mind when I hear Berkeley Systems is acrophobia. And, yes. uh, and is that a beetle? Like, what is and, that? And I, it sort of looks like a ring. How do you get your? How do people put in these like little heads and stuff? And Twitch, I haven't figured that out yet. Yeah. Moose Murphy asks, "This is a good question. Any reason you didn't make it for the 360? Builder would be the best person to well, answer that I question. That. But yeah, we need, I can. We need to be a, a, a official publisher on 360, and we're not. So. Whoa! Whoa. We what lost. did we do? We've lost. Me too. Oh, there we go. All right. So. We almost uh, broke it. Yeah, we. It's harder to self-publish on 360, and we're self-publishing. What is the? We would have to actually. What's the question? I'm sorry. Any reason we're not on 360? Yeah, you can't. There's no um, self-publishing agreement with you know, to become a publisher on 360 is very different uh, than there is to do like ID Xbox or PS3, PS4 allow you to self-publish. So. In theory, we could launch on 360, but we'd have to yes, use sir. a publisher to do it. Um, and so there's, it's just a hurdle. Um, and you know, at this point, we don't know if sales would justify all that work and that rev share with the publisher. So yeah, it's easy to get to those other consoles. Exactly. Uh, I don't know. We might be wrapping it up here pretty. Yeah, soon. I got to go back to work. Uh, we're working on a bunch of new games. Uh, I do want to say, come back next week. Uh, and we're going to debut a new game that hasn't been seen anywhere yet, and as many as 100 of you could play along with us. So that will be next Friday. I'm sorry you guys were trying to join and didn't get in. I think there are any number of uh, games probably being twitched right now, so you can yeah. jump into one of those. Um, but yeah, next Friday, come back. We're going to play a new game. Up to a hundred of you can pass along. <laughs> Jesus Christ, Pope says work is for nerds. Ban your nerd. Uh, you know, this is quite appropriate, this comment. Yeah, right. <laughs> Electric Mayhem asks, is Fibbage selling well? Yes, we're very happy with it. Yes. Keep but on, tell all your friends and keep playing it and keep on tweet about it. it and twitch it and yeah. yeah. It's selling well enough to make us happy, but if you want us to do crazy things like definitely bring it to your country, etc., it needs to Right. If you want it in every platform in every country, and if you want us to go get the rights to Family Feud, somebody wanted that. If you want all those things to happen, it needs to do amazingly well. So keep telling everybody about it. Keep uh, playing it. You basically uh, have seen half the company, I'd say three quarters of the entire company in front of this camera, so yeah, you have to realize how group. small we are. Yep. Yeah. Let's see, we got another question here. Question, what compensation can you provide for warping my sense of humor at an impressionable <laughs> age since I've been playing You Don't Know Jack for many, many years? Sometimes I say things that I really shouldn't say in the presence of other humans, but it's so funny. Uh, what compensation, <laughs> huh? Um, how about our support and our laughs, if you make us laugh? <laughs> That's the best we can do. Yeah. And we'll call you out fifth dream today. Right. <laughs> uh, all right, guys. Definitely follow us on Twitter. Follow us on Facebook uh, at Fibbage, at uh, You Don't Know Jack, at Jack Jackbox Games. Games. You can follow me at, at Mr. Army, Arnie, M I S T E R A R N I E. Builder, what is your? It's Mike Builder. 
Mike Builder. Not Wilder. <laughs> Not Wilder. <laughs> uh, Allard. I'm underscore Allard, A-L-L-A-R-D. Uh, and then on, but I don't really tweet, but I do go on Instagram, so you can follow me on Instagram as Allard, A-L-L-A-R-D. Uh, Henchman Joe, you cannot enter your own questions, but that's a great idea for some future titles, and we've obviously brought that to the to the drawing board here, trying to think about that. Henchman Joe, sadly, we do not have a MySpace. I don't think. <laughs> do we still have a MySpace? We have a GeoCities page. Um, what else? Tribe? We have a tribe. All right. I don't know. Uh, so, yeah, definitely come back next Friday. We're going to play an all-new game, and all of you will Except be able money. to play along. It's very exciting. Uh, I don't exactly know how to stop the stream. <laughs> Let's just leave this on, like, 24 hours. <laughs> yeah, so people can always see us, see what we're working on. Thanks, guys. Thanks so much. We are also not on Friendster, Electric Man. <laughs> uh, who I'm, on, I'm on Tribes. You guys want to follow me on Tribes? I don't think... W <laughs> I'm on Hello, or Ello. Ello? Have you started that? Before? I have an Ello page. Of course you are, because you're always the first person. I, uh, I, yeah, but I don't know what I what to do with it. All right. It's your fault that I'm on Facebook. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, you, like, you started doing that zombie thing, or the oh, werewolf yeah, thing. Oh, yeah, all those horrible early Facebook games <laughs> yes. that I built for you. <laughs> Yeah. Uh, we weird. are on Twitch, Moon Murphy. Yes. We're you're here right now. <laughs> you're fo please follow us on Twitch. Yes, you can. There's a button right now. Twitch. You can click on it. All right. I'm hitting something that I believe is going to make this all stop. Uh